Hey everyone, Rybred here. Welcome to KOTOR Part 3. Now I'm actually just going to continue my series and let's hope that we drive this a little bit quicker pace than what has been going, but it's been a lot of storyline, a lot of stuff to get caught up on and know before we dive further into this. I bet everyone's glad I'm running around with swords hanging out. Probably looks so crippled. Going on over there, bounty hunter. Uh, let's check out this medical facility first. I think I might need, uh, might need the help. Right, maybe if I could go in it. There it is. Can't you see I'm busy with my duties? Go talk to Zelka if you need something. Well, I'm sorry. I thought you actually worked at the medical facility. That's right, whatever. I see from your appearance that you are an off-worlder. Still, you are welcome here. I will not have it said that Selka Foran refused to help somebody just because they weren't a citizen of Taras. Do you require healing or medical supplies? I can treat almost any injury or ailment right here at the medical facility. Except the Raku disease, of course. Hmm. Raku disease? The terrible affliction has plagued Taras for many generations. It is spread by the Rakguls, horrible monsters that live in the Undercity below Terrace's great skyscrapers. Prolonged exposure to the Undercity breeds the disease, and those infected will eventually mutate into Rakguls themselves, becoming mindless beasts that feed on the flesh of others. <laughs> is there, no cure? there is no antidote for the disease, though I heard the Republic scientists at the military base here on Terrace were close to perfecting a cure. Then the Sith arrived. They overran the military base, and now they refuse to allow anyone access to the laboratories inside. The Sith are keeping all the serum for the patrols they send into the Undercity. If I could just get my hands on a sample of that serum, the Rakgul disease could be wiped from the face of Terrace forever. But I don't see how that's going to happen. I don't see how anyone could get their hands on that serum. The military base is crawling with Sith guards. Breaking in there would be a suicide mission. I suppose the Sith patrols in the Undercity might have a sample of the serum on them, if they hadn't already used it because of a rat ghoul infection. But I doubt a patrol would just hand the serum over, and nobody is stupid enough to attack one of the Sith patrols, even in the Undercity. Mm. Pretty much I didn't say what happened, but I was just offering to get it for him. You know, let's be very optimistic here. I'm Please, that don't for say you. that! If the Sith hear you, they might think I'm suggesting you start attacking their patrols. They could shut me down. I only mentioned the serum because you asked. I don't actually expect anyone to get me the serum. Now, is there anything else I can do for you? Mm. It will just take me a moment while I examine your injuries, and then I'll administer the proper treatment. <laughs> Dang, there we go. That's what I'm talking about. Uh, no, let's back this door down. See what you have back here, Doc. What do you have back here? What are you hiding? Just busting down everything anyway, so why not? What are you doing? Don't go in there! That door is for employees only! You recognize these men. They're Republic soldiers. You recognize these soldiers? But how? Unless... Unless you're a friend of the Republic. I'm a friend of the Republic. You can trust me. I, uh... Oh my god, it actually works. what's going on. I only hope the Sith don't find out what I've done. Since the space battle overhead, people have been secretly bringing in these Republic soldiers who crash-landed on the planet. I had to take them in. What choice did I have? Their injuries are terrible. Most won't survive. But at least I can make their last days more comfortable. And at least here, they're hidden away from the Sith. Well, for that, you have my thanks. It's good to know that at least some of these men ended up in compassionate hands. I hate to imagine what the Sith would do if they discovered these soldiers here. But since their initial questioning, the Sith have not returned, so it may be my fears are unfounded. It's all for my help. I'm afraid there's nothing more anyone can do for these soldiers. Now, if you'll excuse me, I should return to the front in case anyone comes in needing medical attention. Oh yeah, get my first light side points. No, don't trust that guy. He's a you there. Wait a minute. I need to talk to you about the Rakgul serum. I've got an offer for you you might want to hear. Uh, Zelka is the only one who wants to get his hands on the Rakgul serum. 
Davik Kang will pay you ten times what Selka can, if you can get the cure. Oh, Davik come Kang on. Is. Everybody knows who Davik Kang is. He's the big boss around here. Gambling, smuggling, extortion. He's got a piece of all the action on Taris. Mm, so Davik's interested in anything that can turn a profit. He could make a fortune selling the serum to anyone infected with the disease. Not like Zelka, who'll practically give it away. Alright, I'm starting to see uh, a definite light and dark side path here. You know, I'll just keep and then only the rich could afford the cure. Just let the poor suffer, right? If you find the Rakul serum, just take it to Zax in the lower city bounty office. He works for Davik. He'll pay you what that cure is really worth. Yeah, that's probably not gonna happen. I'm kind of infringing on my life side path here. Davik says you missed your last payment. Yeah, that guy for the medic center. <laughs> He's pretty much saying he doesn't like here, missing payments. I've got 50 credits, a down payment. That should buy me some time, right? Sorry, you're out of time. Now it's all or nothing. Davik can't have people not paying his debts. But I don't have that much. How can I give you credits I don't have? Apparently we're going to make an example of this. I can stop this. No! Help! Somebody help! They're going to kill me! I know we have to be careful about drawing attention to ourselves, but... Are we going to just let them drag this guy off? Hold on a second. Looks like we got ourselves a witness here. You're doing it in public. How are there witnesses? Look at that, there's a woman right there! How is this not public? You know what, they're gonna have to deal with me if they mess with this old man. He's gonna teach me a lesson. Alright, let's uh... Let's stick with this... The power of here. You know, I'm just gonna let Karth deal with all this. Those bounty hunters are going to take me away and kill me. My life warned me not to take a loan from Tavik. No, I can't pay him back. It's not good to owe a crime lord money. He'll just keep sending more bounty hunters after me till I'm dead. Oh, jeez. Uh, you already me helped me by them. saving me from those bounty hunters, so unless you have a spare 100 credits to give me so I can pay off Davik, there's nothing else you can do. Yeah, who needs money? Who needs who needs money? Give me 100 credits? Just like that? I I don't know what to say. Thank you. Thank you. You're giving him 100 credits? Generous. Now I can pay off Davik. You've saved my life. Thank you. I'd better take these credits to him right away. Getting them light side points. Now the good part, seeing what they had on them. 50 credits. I like that. I like that. I literally broke even on this deal. See here, upper city. So I guess this is the lower city. We pretty much have the medic station, the cantina, and our apartments. Let's go to the upper city. See what, see what we have in store over here. Hmm. Check out straight across. See what we have. Right, more apartments. You know what, my guy actually kind of sucks. Let's just continue the dual wielding bit here. Alright. Alright, ready. So gonna Karth, then he's gonna bust down this door. On it. It's open. So yes? He knows security, so I guess that's pretty useful. Largo. Let's see what you have here, Largo. <laughs> yeah, uh, let's see, let's see, let's see, what, let's see what you have. Please. Please don't hurt me. You don't have to kill me. I'll have Davik's money if he if he just gives me a little more time. Please. I don't want to die. Here, 
I've got 50 credits on me. That's all I've got. It's yours. Just don't tell Dabak where I'm hiding, okay? I'm begging you. I have a feeling I'm gonna have a choice where I can give him money, but let's see if I'm gonna hurt him. You're not here to kill me? But I, I thought you were one of Dabak's bounty hunters. If you're not here to kill me, what do you want? I just wanted to break in your apartment and steal all your goods. <laughs> I pretty much already accomplished that though. Mm, oh no. You know what? I'm being nice. I don't think anyone we'll see can where help this me. Goes. I owe Davik money, and I was late with the payment. So he went to Zach's in the bounty office and put a price on my head. I've been hiding here ever since. But sooner or later, someone will find me. Unless I somehow come up with another 200 credits, I'm a dead man. Oh jeez, I think that's like everything I have. Why? Why am I being nice? You'd give 200 credits to a stranger just to help them out? <laughs> I don't believe it. Well, uh, thank you. Wow, that sure was generous of you. I just hope we don't end up needing those credits later we on. We probably will. Probably. Now I can pay we off Davik. Oh, thank you. You saved my life. Oh, I better go give this to Davik right away. Some the light side points going on here. Although it might be crippling me in the long run. But why do you why do you need credits? You know you don't you don't need money. You don't need money where I'm a space explorer. You probably do. Oh, he leaves a door open. He leaves a door open. You know, I'm not gonna complain. They have ten I'm actually down 190 credits now because there's ten credits in there. He's the only visitor that is trapped by the quarantine. He knows nothing. Nothing. I'm going to paraphrase what they say from now on. Maybe, depending on how you feel. Mm, you know, let's be nosy. You're a little too curious for your own good, civilian. This doesn't concern you. I know all about Sith interrogations. This isn't going to end well. I'm getting sick of your lies, you alien scum. We've got your ugly mug and a security tape from the base. Start talking before I splatter your slimy brains all over this room. Uh-oh. I think the commander's losing his temper. I'm glad I'm out of here. It took me an hour to clean the bloodstains from my uniform after the last interrogation. Mm. Yeah, maybe, well, stay maybe out of this he doesn't you know actually good for you. I know he's not gonna tell the commander, but let's see here. You know, I'm not gonna do whatever he wants. What was that? Did I hear you right? Let us kill him? How can you stop us? Time to teach the civilian the, the penalty for the Sith. Mm. 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 Sorry if the screen got a little bit orange. I have f locks on my computer. Blue or not actually does help, but when I'm trying to do color sensitive work like this, it doesn't necessarily help too much. Alright, so he's right here, so I'm just going to provide firepower, since I still suck, so I'm just going to control Karth here. I'm going to do that power attack. Yes. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Sure. That's much better. Oh, what the? Oh, something I thought... Like a car that's like dancing around him. There we well, go. I'm almost dead again. No, I have sip on him. It's pretty much the same thing. Chris, you guys can read him. I'm pretty sure about that one. Alright, same. So did, did steal the uniforms. I'll see who the next are. 
Two games I could hit them both are gathering resources to one day strike against the Sith oppressors. Mm. I'll see if he can take me there. Okay, well. Probably doesn't know anything. He's gonna hide these bodies. Actually, he's just gonna run out of here. That's fine, just leave me here. Just leave me here. No! Alright, I'm actually gonna be right back. Alright guys, I'm actually gonna be right back. I'm actually just gonna go to the medic, get healed, and pretty much return to the spot right up here. Alright guys, I'm back. It's pretty much got healed. So let's see what the rest of the upper district is all about. What is this planet coming to, huh? <gasps> Shlami's just walking around the upper city. Shouldn't you go to Laura says you belong, Shlami? Oh, this is rich. Yeah, like he said. These streets are for upper city citizens. <laughs> you better get out of the way if you know what's good for you. Uh, I don't want to get dark side, but I kind of really want to pick this option. Uh, you know what, let's go for it. Uh, come on, fellas. This shot me ain't worth the bother. Uh, uh, yeah. I guess you're right. Maybe next time, Slummy. Come on, fellas, let's go. Yeah, that's right. The fellas back off. Drunk ass people back off. Droid shop. I wonder if I could get another droid, so then I could have two people following me. Let's see what happens here. Look at this little guy. Okay. Well, that sounds good. She said welcome. I'm a new face. Hmm. You'd think people would be a little more tolerant of others in this day and age. <laughs> I guess stupidity and ignorance will never go out of style. Genchopa chawi tichok twis yun kun watu yama kama wona henak neck bugra shak kun tichi wa mchawa dong abu shami no no. Oh, sorry, I was kind of like no, no. blanking out there. Chine pala mule. Focus on the story. Tichi ba non tontek tuni cha chon kun ne mule brabast. Let's see what they have to say. Oh, no. no back money guarantee. Uh, let me see your Kaki droids. Um, yeah, let's just go. Run. Gary. Mm. Doesn't really sound too good, but that's okay. Nothing that doctor can fix. Nothing that doctor can fix. No! You know what? I'm getting my money back from this bitch. My money. Run the e chawa to can chop a chawi ti chop twees yun kun. How could she not know he exploded? It literally right outside her right outside her shop. Look at that. Right here. She's right there. Like I, you could not hear an explosion. She probably just heard the explosion and was hoping that I wouldn't even notice and that I would just carry on. A playing. plague spreads through our streets. We cannot sit idly by one. All right, so that's the Sith, uh, Sith Command Center. Let's see what we have here. This elevator is off limits. Only Sith patrols and those with proper authorization are allowed into the lower city. 
It's obvious from the way you're dressed that you're not one of the Sith patrols, so unless you have the authorization papers, you must move along. If you were supposed to have them, you'd know where to get them. Now quit wasting my time and move along. Move along, then. We're gonna need some kind of disguise if we want to get past this guy. Thank you, Karth. You know what? I'm gonna get dressed right in front. Uh -huh. What? Oh, wait. Kind of. Uh... Damn it. Damn it. What's up, bro? Hey, how's it hanging? Bro, I need to uh, need to get past the store, man. Are you gonna let me through? Are you gonna let me through? Uh, you know, I need to talk to you. You already know I have access. You already know. Right, since it's a bunch of gang violence down here, maybe sure. I should take it off. Let's see here. There we go. Well, I said there was gang violence, so looks like something's gonna break down here. Oh shit, Vex are nothing but Bantha fodder! Vultures, bro. Vultures are strongest. And he's all saying, like, yeah, bro, we'll teach you who's stronger. But then he gets all stabbed and he dies somehow. <laughs> Well, this is kind of really sad on their part, saying they're strong, so the walkers are actually stronger. Alright, see, I don't, I don't know what the problem is with strangers. I, what do you, I don't understand. Like, I was just here, and you're just gonna try to kill me? Uh, we're going to play the note, he's not even looking. So, we're gonna have to do his Ready. thing. Okay, well, they're beating the shit out of him. Um... See if I can get a sword, fire blade. Let's go. <laughs> Both attacks just miss me. What, what the heck? I'm not even attacking anybody. Oh, you be sitting it up in here, boy. Yeah, let's get the repair kit. Take all their garbage. Shock stick. Repair kit, med kit, and a very small amount of money. Alright guys, I'm kind of going to be a lame ass. I'm actually going to go back, track to that doctor, get healed again, and come back to the spot. Alright, actually I'm back. I realize that we didn't talk to this man. I believe we, we can't talk to him, so we are to run well. with the vermin invaders. Friends and fellow humans, I bring you a warning. A warning of a great plague spreading across our planet. Please, listen to me. My name is Gorton Kono. Will you join my cause? We must band together if we are to stop the spread of vermin and scum throughout Taris. Hmm. I am speaking of the hideous looking aliens who walk the world of Taurus. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You're being racist, bro. All of them. You're being Listen, racist. Oh, Wookiees, Athorians, Rodians. Oh, that is Beth. why I, Gorton Kolu, have formed the Anti Alien League. The time has come for action. Yeah, it's a bunch of we racist cannot people. sit idly by while aliens blight our glorious planet. I didn't think it'd be race, but it'd be species. The you Seems are like all the rest. Modern. You will not see the truth. On the day of reckoning, you will suffer with the rest of the alien lovers. Come on, we should keep moving. Cook or no, people like him can make trouble for us. That's true, Carth. You keep me back from that fool. No standing. No telling what I'm going to do. All right, we're back. We got healed. Officially back. Let's check out this undercity here, see what we have going on. Right, more apartments. There's a lot of apartments here in this little part of town. Uh, let's talk to the sentry droid. We have nine parts so you know, let's try it here. Um, uh, 
probably shouldn't have repaired it. I probably need those parts for later. But it's just gonna go and mow people down, I'm hoping. Woo! Oh, look at that shot. Somehow, I'm an incredible dodger. Incredible dodger. Alright, let's beat the shit out of this guy. Alright, Kirby, I can get some. Oh, yeah. Med packs. This guy doesn't have anything. Can I contain Oh, yeah. Oh, look at it, man. It is clearing house. Or at least I think it is anyway. Oh, yeah. I like that. I like the flavor of that. Can't remember for sure, but I thought there was a harder part in this area. So maybe the robot here will make you go by a lot smoother. I guess if I keep up with him anyway. I mean, he's almost, almost destroyed. Oh jeez, alright, alright, now it's a big firefight. Uh, I doubt I can do this. Seems like I can. Actually not as uh, useful as I thought it was. Uh, I wonder, I wonder if I can get that stun stick also. I wonder if that's a... Uh, Hmm. Can I dual wield? No, it's just it's a shock sticker. No. Yeah, I'll be uh, I'll be car support. If I stun him. Oh, that's really helpful. Really and the fact that I suck is helping this guy a lot. Blaster, a shock stick, some of that adrenaline. You know what? I'm actually not going to go to the doctor this time. Might be easier. No way. Twisted Rancor Trio. All right, let's read what this says. Guts and Glory, a chronicle of the amazing story of the Twisted Rancor Trio. The origins of what would eventually become the most famous band in the galaxy are surprisingly humble. Alright, I'm pretty much gonna try referring back to that entry and coming back here. But it's just pretty much about a startup of a band. Um, from what I assume to be a puzzle. Mmm. One with the eye. Just doing the band members in chronological order. All, right, all I know is Lupa is next. What? Sure. And I'm just trying to look for a name in here. So let's do a photo. And Shonda. Okay, good. Good. Fiber armor. What? Sure. Hmm. Let's equip some of that now, actually. Oh, there we go. Now we're looking good. Stuck. Okay, let's see. Stuck on nothing. You know what? Ready. Let's like car deal with this. I'm just on gonna. It. It's gonna continue to back and forth. It's open. Get I'm wondering why it's upset. Oh, he's kind of pissed off. So I see if I could, uh, uh, he wants me to leave alone. Left alone. Uh, he's yelling at me, so I'm gonna leave. Not, not before he's still his stuff. Oh, well, I'm actually kind of borrowing it for now. I'm just gonna borrow it. You know what, my persuasions have not been working. I'm really surprised they worked on that one guy. Alright, 
Okay, we're done with the apartments. Let's search for more apartments somewhere, I guess we'll find out. Let's see what this corpse is about. Yep, I'm looking at the corpse. Red packs. Man. I'm not even doing anything. I think, pretty sure I'm just gonna say. It's Carthy and stuff. Yeah, Ready. Sure, that's in there. You know, this stun chance is not even coming up. Well, he sucks just as bad as. Oh, never mind. Alright, let's, let's see if Carth could actually do it. You know, I'm actually getting slightly worried. Please don't do this one. Oh no, I can't remember where I saved it. I'm lucky it actually saved right at the apartment door, so we're actually gonna stop messing around with me. Let's actually give me, what it was, a Karth Blaster and, oh, what's this Heavy Blaster? Alright guys, I'm actually out of time for this video. I want to thank you guys again for watching. In the next video, Karth and I are going to go kick both of those guys' asses, as well as explore the rest of this lower level. Um, we're going to have to see if the Hidden Becks are somewhere, see if they can help us with our mission of getting off this planet, see if they can help us find Basla, either one of the two, or maybe even find the Rackville Seer. With that being said, I hope you guys are enjoying the videos, and keep on watching. Click like, click subscribe. If you're enjoying it, leave comments down below. You're encouraged to do so. I want to hear what you have to say. You can follow me on Twitter, follow me on Google, Instagram. More active on Twitter at the moment. But follow me, comment, like, subscribe. Keep up with my videos. I'm going to keep on posting videos of this. I have a series about Soma going on. I'm trying to do multiple things as well as play games with my friends. But I want to thank you guys again. And as always, I will see you guys next time. Perfect. You know, I'm not going to play the role.